Hey everyone, it's Brandy and welcome back to part 17 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Rose Family. So, um, this is still in the same day that I filmed the last two parts, the two parts I put up last week when this is going up. Um, I went ahead and took out the MC Command Center mod just because, as you guys saw at the end of part 16, I believe I kept getting a bunch of notifications towards the end of that part. And I really didn't understand why I was getting that. So I just went ahead and took it out for now. And I'm going to wait to see if it's updated or if the game receives an update. You know, I'm just going to wait till I receive any updates about that. Before I ended the game, I did set it to have her go and take a pregnancy test. But when I came in, like when I opened the game back up to see what would happen, it was actually canceled at <laughs> She has a negative relationship with uni. I didn't know that, like, people older than children, you know, the children that play with it could have a relationship with it. But when she's mad, she also, like, she's always, or she just started recently yelling at it. So, you know, she has a bad relationship with it. Um. Anyway, but when I opened the game up, that had actually canceled out. Um. I think it might have skipped some time because I don't think... It was 5 a.m. when I closed the game down. I'm pretty sure it wasn't, five, it wasn't, you know, I'm pretty sure it wasn't close to 5 a.m. when I closed the game down. But, um, with that being said, you know, I, when I opened up the game, what I was saying was that I, I automatically got the notification. I guess she got up out the bed. She got the notification and now she's pregnant. So, um, it didn't go away because I took the mod out, which I do appreciate. And you can see I had got all of those notifications and like maybe, excuse me, sorry. And maybe about like the last five minutes that I was filming my or recording my part, I had got all these notifications about a script error, which has something to do with the MC Command Center. Um, so for now, I'm just not going to be able to play with that, which is fine because I was just Really, the main reason I was using it was for Risky Woohoo, and I had also turned on, oh, excuse me, I got hiccups. I don't know why I have hiccups. Um, I had also used it to turn on the Autonomous Woohoo, and I'm wondering maybe that's what the issue was, because it wasn't on before. Um, I just, I didn't have that on before, and then I turned it on in either the last part or the part right before the last part that I put up. So that could be the issue, but I'm not sure. I didn't completely delete it off my computer. I just took it out of my mods folder so I can see if it would work. And um, I'm guessing some glitches might have been fixed because, you know, I tried to update my game and it said it was all up to date and I repaired it one more time when I, once I closed it. But I'm guessing it was more glitches going on than I thought it was because one, Tim isn't here anymore and... As you guys noticed from the last few parts, he was like constantly here and like he just he just kept showing up for no reason. And he would just come in and walk in. No invitation, you know, not because he had the apartment key. He was just coming in. So he's no longer here. I noticed that, like I mentioned in like I just mentioned, and I'm probably saying this for like the third or fourth time, but time has passed. I, I'm guessing it was something more going on. But some time has passed. Some of her knees are definitely better. They're not the best right now, but they're better than they were when I closed out of the game and I haven't played any. I just opened and loaded the game up. So, yeah. Um, I don't know what's going on with Sadie right now. Had another nightmare, of course. So, it looks like she's waking up. I'm guessing she might have also broken her dollhouse or somebody did because um, I think you guys saw it, but the neighbor that lives here he was making a whole bunch of noise last night so she was mad and Tim was mad and Sadie were, was mad so all of them were walking around here just angry and I know she was yelling at the at uni Tim was also yelling at uni and I'm guessing Sadie broke her dollhouse because that seems to be all she likes to do um but with that being said I'm going to go ahead and start the part because I just just trying to, you know, show you guys what's going on or tell you guys what's going on because I didn't know what was going on. I kind of I just opened it up and I'm guessing the game kind of just fixed itself for me. Um, but yeah, she, like I said, she just found out she's pregnant. Um, what does she want to do? She wants to go watch her. We're going to actually have you go take a shower. 
and then I might have her go back to sleep because oh never mind he's here he's back and yeah I don't know if you guys caught that at the end of the last part but because they were all mad like he kept I think he was lecturing her or something so their relationship went down and they're no longer friends which I was trying to get up higher um but it just it wasn't working um I think I'm going to I might ask him to move in in this part just to help take care of things around the house and I believe he is in the scientist career and I don't want him to be in that career so I'm gonna have him move out and I found out I think I mentioned this in the last part as well but I figured out what was wrong with my headphones it's really weird because um I have to do some it's like multi-channel thing so I can record through the mic as well as record the audio for the gameplay and when I do that I have to see now this is still too loud for me um, when I do that, I have to, um, that's, that's going to be too much. I don't know why that's so loud. I'm sorry. I keep, I'm, I'm losing what I'm saying. But when I do, when I change it so I can make sure everything can be heard while I'm recording, I can't adjust my volume through my actual computer because I have like a button that I can just change the vol volume with but I can't do that when I have it set up to record so um I had I had turned the volume down because I was watching videos and stuff and you know when you watch videos on YouTube cer certain people can be really loud so I think I had just watched a really loud person the last time and I had turned it down and I forgot to turn it back up so when I was complaining about why I couldn't hear it was because of that but I have turned it up and now once again it's too loud so that's why I kept changing the audio but yeah she's pregnant her belly actually isn't that big and I can't check the gender because I no longer have the MC command center in which sucks because I wanted to know what it was gonna be um actually we're gonna let her do that and she's hungry but she also does have work so I want her to go to sleep you know what before we do that I'm gonna have her pack up some pizza into a sack lunch so she could take that with her okay stop talking to her she needs to like go back to sleep she'll probably end up being completely fine by the time she looks so cute pregnant. <laughs> um, okay. Very we we need you. I need you to take that with you. We're gonna actually take another slice. Yeah, she's not gonna have time to go back to sleep. So we're actually just gonna have her watch some TV to at least get her fun up and she might just have to take a nap at work. Because the game sucks. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't expecting her to wake up or be up when I came back into the game. So if we talk to him, will um will her fun go up faster? I don't know. Like I almost thought this was his baby. <laughs> I forgot that it's not. So, um, he's excited. So, it's good to know that, you know, whatever happens, he'll be there to support her. I think he might be family-oriented, but I'm not completely sure about this. The TV is freaking loud. And I don't think you could turn it down. Uh, yeah, no, you can't change the volume. I want to see... We're going to make out because that's actually locked in. And if she could get that done before she leaves for work, that would be nice. Yep. And she wants to give Sadie a hug. So we're going to lock that in so when she gets home from work, she can do that. And we're going to go to work with her because that's what we do. 
I was going to film another part, but I think I'm going to just stick to my three parts tonight because I mentioned in my last part, I believe, that I need to get up early. Me and my mother are going on a walk in the morning. You know, we're trying to work up into doing more exercises. We went on our first walk yesterday. So, I, um, yeah, I need to get up to go do that. And then I have some things that I need to do around the house, too. Is she still, she's still only one trimester, right? Wait, 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 what? Wait, what are you throwing away? What are you throwing away? Was this, like, the leftover? I think those are leftover plates from, okay. She still has her sack lunch. I thought she was throwing away her sack lunch for a minute. I was like, girl, I don't know how you pack that so you throw it in the garbage. So we're, we're just going to start on him. Why can't I deliver food? Examine patient, take temperature. And she's already hungry. Great. But I'm, yeah, I'm just going to have her. Oh, crap. I didn't start my timer again. So you guys are probably going to get another long part just because unless I skip out some of the stuff. But I doubt it. I think I'll just have a longer part. Because I forgot to start my timer again and I suck. Sorry. I just drank up the rest of my juice that I was drinking. And hopefully I don't need anything else because I don't think I have anything. Oh, well, I have some water in front of me. I'm just sorry. I drank the most of that. Cause my throat is still feeling a little itchy or scratchy. I usually don't talk this much on a regular basis. I mean, I do work answering phone calls, but I don't, you know, continuously talk. So <clears throat> every time I try to film, my throat gets a little scratchy because I'm just like talking too much. Um, uh, girl, chill out. Okay, let me go ahead and let her eat one of these things with pizza. Because she keeps trying to go eat something. And I'm trying to get you a promotion. Hurry up. Are you going to go eat your pizza? Oh, she came in here. Is, isn't there a TV somewhere in here? Who is this? He's new. Because I've never seen him before. Okay. So I guess we're going to go do that. Is she done? Yeah, she's done with her pizza. No, stop it. Did she get it already? No, she didn't. Okay. Um, actually, no. I have to go to the front desk and do it. We're going on another house call. We need to hurry up and do that so we can come back and hopefully have a surgery that we can do. Because I believe she would, she's like in a position to get a promotion today if she does everything that she needs to do. Hopefully that works out. We'll see. But I don't know yet. Come on, game. Come on. Sorry, I wasn't talking. Oh, is this the Fangs apartment? This is, apartment is huge. I kind of wanted to move her into one of these, but I, I think this is actually the apartment next to, I think the Fangs live over here. I was going to try to move her into this apartment, but I knew she couldn't afford it. Like, she could barely afford to live where she's at now. And I think this one was like one of those ones that was 20000 or something like that a week. And I'm just like, ooh, maybe later down the line. But, you know, she's not making enough. And being a single mom and she's pregnant again. But this is so nice. And, like, because I'm not a real big builder, I probably would have left the layout and just changed the design, you know, changed the way, the interior design, basically. I would have changed that. So... Yeah, that would have been nice to do. <laughs> okay, so he's done. I feel like I keep getting the same people for this. I don't know why. I'm like, I know there's way more people in the town, you know, in the world than this. It's just like it's big for no reason. They got so much room. 
I mean, I know my bathtub was like that, but the bathroom, our bathroom or her bathroom is, is big, but it's not that big. Because all of this is technically part of the bathroom. It's just counter space. And give her some medicine. And then we need to do this. It's like the same people every single time. I know, I think you guys didn't see maybe the first one, first or one or two times that I did it. But it's like a rotation of the same people. This kitchen though. This kitchen is huge and it's open and I love it. And I might have to take this inspiration if I have enough room in the house one day. I do want to make a kitchen one day with one of those, um, the, the, the experimental thingy thing, Majig. I don't know. The one that came with, um, the food. What was that? It wasn't get together. Dine out. The, the dine out game pack where you can make the experimental meals and stuff like that. I want to make a kitchen where it's included like an in-house kitchen where that's included. Can she like go to sleep on one of these beds? I don't know if she's going to I'm like you're rude because don't none of them live here. Or is this bed better? Actually I think this one is better over here. I'm being real ignorant right now. <laughs> Oh, great. And she has morning sickness because she laid down for like two seconds. Um, This is terrible because she's supposed to be working. But if I can get her energy up way better than if she, you know, napping on a bench at work, then I would prefer to do that. And then I can always have her stay late if I need to because, you know, I'm actually getting her needs where they need to be. Um... She gets off at 6. She might be able to get it done at 2. I'm not going to let her stay past 2. It just sucks because energy is just her knees when she's pregnant. It's really just like these three. Okay. We're going to have you. You're going to have to get up. You got to go back to work, girl. I'm sorry. I know you want to sleep, but... You gotta go back and finish work. I don't think I don't think they would like you sleeping on a job, you know. They don't know because they're not there, but still. Okay, it's still a little slow, but I feel like it's not quite as laggy as it was, so <coughs> excuse me. MC Command Center was doing something to my game. Don't know what. I'm actually have her. Can I like cancel out of that and she won't go throw up? Because I don't want her to throw up. I don't feel like dealing with that. Okay, yeah. She's not going to throw up. But she's going to go use the bathroom. And who is this? Cecil. Is anybody here that I was actually testing on? We're going to go and refer him for a treadmill test, even though I think she still can't read that, but that's okay. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do any more parts tonight because my throat is not happy right now. <clears throat> really? Come on. What is the matter with her? Oh my goodness. She is not being taken care of. I don't know who watching her. But would y'all feed my baby, please? Uh, all these people weren't checked in before. And I don't know what's going on and why all of them are here like this. Compelling diagnosis. It's like four options. Really, people? And they kill me because they're supposed to show the symptoms, but they haven't really been showing symptoms. And I think they have the hospital overbooked. So I think it's way too many people than there are beds open. So she only brought two slices of pizza. So. Um, okay, let me open up my thing. 
time or possible ailment, continue with examinations and test if diagnosis is not rendered. Okay, we're going to go to that. This boy took his bed. I just hate why why are all the nurses just like not doing anything. Like why is there are so many people in here, there are not enough beds. And I'm not understanding why all these people are checked in if there's not enough room for them all. Okay, we're, we're we don't have time for that. He's just gonna have to stand there until there's room for somebody else. So I think he might have a llama flu because um he caught he's coughing, he's sneezy. I don't know if he has a fever, but he has these splotchy things. And I think that's the only thing. What's that? What all of those? Um, okay. Sorry, I'm trying to look. I was trying to look at the the symptoms for the different illnesses so I can try to figure out which one goes with what I'm looking for. I promise, I think half the people that come in here, there's nothing wrong with them. They're just sitting here like him or her. I think it's a him. Lucas? Yeah, Lucas Mitch. Girl, I know you, you, you're not having fun. I, I need you to do what I asked you to do. Yeah, she, she, I want her to stay late. She's not going to get a promotion today because she still needs to do that. Um... Check eyes. I don't know. Okay, no, I didn't do that job. Weak diagnosis available. What is weak diagnosis? I don't think nothing wrong with him, to be honest. Uh, we're going to discuss general health. I did scan his body already. I don't think I took a sample from him. Um, we're going to do weak diagnosis, and we're going to do no illness. I don't think anything's wrong with him. <coughs> Excuse me. Girl, come on. Okay, that wasn't right. Sorry, kid. You wasn't showing any signs. See, that's the problem that I have. They, um, there's supposed to be something wrong with them, but they don't show any symptoms. I'm like, how am I supposed to figure it out? Oh, crap. I meant to make her stay late, but that's okay. She could go home because her mood was not looking too hot. So, we can, you know, or she can just go home. I'm sure Tim will be there because he's like always there nowadays. Um, wanna go grab dinner? You know what? Let's go. Because I don't know when the last time I hung out with her. And we're actually going to bring... Where is she? Bailey. Because last time she asked me out, I kind of ditched her. So we're just going to bring her too. I probably should have brought Bella Goss too. Because I think we were kind of friends with her. But that's okay. It's fine. I was about to start singing and I realized that I'm recording. And I'm sure you guys don't want to hear my terrible singing. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm not going to do that. You know what? I just realized I have to pay for them. And she's pregnant and wearing this. No, yeah, no. We're going to uh, change your outfit. And we're going to put on that dress. I should probably change her outfit. But I don't feel like it yet. So we need a table with three seats at least. This place looks really fancy, so it's probably super expensive. And I can't afford to pay for everybody. But, you know, we're going to figure something out. Uh, I think we're going to sit downstairs because I think there, hopefully there should be a bathroom here somewhere. Um, and we're just going to sit right up here. We're going to sit by the front. 
I don't think there's anybody here actually playing the piano, but we'll sit up front by the window. I could sit outside, but I don't know if they can sit and eat at these tables. She looks so cute pregnant. Uh, she has 11 hours until her second trimester. And she's just over here playing the piano like, okay. I've never used this toilet before. I requested the table. Okay, yeah, we got the table because she's sitting. Really? Oh my goodness. It's just a mess. I'm going to have to invite Kevin over later because I don't want to ditch her friends because she hasn't hung out with them and I don't know how long. Hopefully I don't get like copyrighted or anything for this music that's playing. Um, I know, I feel like people usually just mute the music. Really? Somebody always walking in behind the bathroom. I don't get it. But I'm gonna make sure she eats good. I don't know how well I'm gonna feed her friends because, uh, you know, she ain't got money like that. <laughs> she got a new baby on the way. I think, well, I don't know. They might have people, but. Okay, so I think we're going to get some lemonade for everybody. Some of this is new stuff. I've never seen it. Like this, this, the Sunset Valley. I've seen Sea of Fire. I haven't seen Granny Smash and Iced Tea. I don't know if those came with a, like a pack or something or Citrus Swig. I haven't seen these before. Um, I think I'm going to get her lemonade and then I'll get the other two, maybe the fizzy fruit drink or something like that. Because this is like a, like a early dinner type of thing. So yeah, I get both of them that and then, hmm, is this like a breakfast cake? Uh... Ooh, that looks good. The Monte Cristo sandwich. I think I might get her that. Oh, the spinach and mushroom quiche. That sounds really good. I kind of want one of those right now. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to get her the sandwich. Ooh, berry macaroons. Those look good. I've never had any of those. I would like to try them, but I don't know where to get them where I'm at. So, yeah. We're not going to get dessert. We're going to... I hope none of them are like vegetarians or anything. Um, is this the cheapest? Uh, we'll get them pancakes and she'll get a sandwich. Or should I get them? Actually, we'll get them the spinach frittata. Yeah. So it's not too expensive, but yeah. Um, Oh, she's just watching her screen. So both stout family. Let's just talk to them. Why is she just standing here? Sit down, girl. Yeah, I don't want to have any of them move in here. I like having them as her friends, but I, I, I don't really want to have to worry about their lives. <laughs> I know that probably sounds a little crazy, but it's too much. Hopefully she doesn't pass out. I was going to have Kevin come over tonight, but maybe not. Uh, she doesn't have work tomorrow. So I don't have to worry about that. But. Yeah, she is pretty tired. Who was that that just walked past? Um, I thought that was somebody. Oh, that's the guy that works at the, um hospital that's the new nurse it's kind of crazy looking looks like he's a fun person though i really wish this girl would sit down okay i'm gonna just speed this up so they can get their food and then she can go home and go to bed don't joke about ducks sure why not <laughs> Oh my goodness, their food is taking forever. Where's the kitchen? Oh, is it finally here? I just don't want her to like pass out before she could get home. Please eat your food. 
eat, 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 eat. They talk too much. <laughs> so I, I at least know whenever she gets married, she'll at least have a couple friends she can invite. At least we know these two will be there for sure. They're too busy sniffing the food. Just eat. And this lady all trying to be all up in their conversation. She's so pretty. She is too. I'm sorry. I'm just like not paying attention. Oh no. She's missing her baby. She's missing family. <laughs> oh, they're cute. Okay, we're going to have to go home now. Bring out cake. Yeah, no. We're going to end the meal and pay for our bills so she can go home. And then we're going to go ahead and go home because she needs to go home. Um, she's going to be aging up in a couple days, I think. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I meant to work on her skills, but I mean, they're not terrible. I think she has at least one skill in, mo in all of the skills she could possibly have. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think two of them are at level four. And then she mastered her potty skill. And then thinking, I think, is not very high at all. And... We're going to go and hug her. I'm sorry, but go hug her. Hopefully you don't pass out. And then you can go to sleep. Yeah, she ages up in two days. Technically one because this day is almost over. So she'll be a child before she has the baby, which will be nice. Um, I'm still debating. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna move her out this room, and then you know the new baby can be in here, and she can have this bigger room over here. And depending on how things work out, I don't want to have to mess around with the walls or anything. So I probably won't split this room up, but I can always move this either out here or into her actual room and then if I need to I can make this little because I think this is supposed to be like a walk-in closet this little space on the corner of her room over here um I can always make that like a second bathroom if I need it because I don't think she's gonna have any money to move out I really don't want to move her in the house I would like to get her a penthouse so it's like she's technically living in the house but she's still in the city because that's one thing that I haven't done yet and I would really like to do that so yeah I wish there was some the gnomes would clean up the dishes and stuff um but yeah she has a day off today so she gets to spend the entire day she wants to volunteer with her family I think I might save that and so when Sadie ages up she can actually go and volunteer with her because now I think she has one day I kind of want to age her up now like age her up in this part maybe i'll play just one more day even though i already know it's probably like a two you know what i'm not i'm gonna just film another part i said i wasn't but i think i'm gonna just go ahead and film another part because she's so close to aging up and i always do this because I, I just i want to know i want to know um we're gonna have her go potty and yeah we can spend that part Working on her skills. She's only level three of movement, which I find really weird. I'm so used to all my sim callers like maxing out the commit the communication and their movement is the two things that they max out the fastest just because um they're always running around the house. But I guess because she doesn't really have a whole lot of area and plus I always leave and go to work with Destiny, so I'm not really around her that much. So yeah um she wants to take a slice i kind of want to get a microwave so okay but i don't know where to put it 
maybe I can just get rid of, I don't want to get rid of that. Um, I think I'm gonna just finally go ahead and get rid of these because she really doesn't use those. I wanted her to, oh, where does this stuff come from? She got all kind of free stuff. I'm like, oh, I want to keep this. Um, I don't know where I want to put it. It's just like her, her medical degree. You know how they keep those. Okay, I'm going to leave that in her inventory for now. Uh, and I already forgot what I was going to get. Jeez. Oh, a microwave. <laughs> I was like, what am I supposed to be getting? And I know for sure I'm going to have to get a, a dining set soon. Because there are only two chairs here. And obviously, I mean, it would have been fine if it was just destiny and sadie but since she is pregnant again she's going to eventually need more tables or more more you know more seating areas and i would like for them to sit and eat dinner as a family how much is this i don't i wish they had a microwave that came with um the kitchen stuff okay my timer was there i'm gonna finish getting this microwave and then i'm gonna stop and then That doesn't match because it's like silver and black. And she really doesn't need like a thousand dollar microwave. Because all of them be staying cold in the middle anyway. Okay, that's better. Okay. So I'm sure you guys heard that. That was my timer. I'm actually going to go ahead and end this part here. And then I'm just going to go ahead and film the next part right away. I've been doing that lately, like filming four parts in one day and then I'm set for the next two weeks all I have to do is edit the videos which I think is completely fine so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and do that and yeah I will see you guys again in the next part